Let's make one more tutorial in Autodesk Fusion. In this tutorial, we will learn how to use the Sweep Surface, Patch Surface, Surface Loft, Surface Stitch, Split Body, and the other features. So open your Fusion and let's go. Go to Assembly New Component, rename this to Surface Exercise, press OK. Now go to create a sketch, select the front plane, select the arc, center point arc, click here in the midpoint, make an arc here. The radius is 30 millimeters, 90 degrees here. Finish the sketch. Now go to create a sketch, select the top plane, go to create project, include project, select this point here and press OK. Go to create and select ellipse. Click here, the distance here, 30 millimeters. Okay. Now go to constraint, select the coincident, select this point here and this point here. Go to sketch dimension. The distance between these two points here is 10 millimeters. Now select a line, make a line here between these two points. Go to trim, cut here. Now select this line here, make this a construction line and finish the sketch. We made this two sketch here. Now go to surface and select sweep. The profile is this ellipse here and the path is this arc. Press OK. We made this, OK. Now go to Construct, select the Offset Plane, select the right plane here, make an offset here, the distance is 30 millimeters, press OK. Now go to Create a Sketch and select the, this new plane here. Go to Create and select the Project Include, Project, select this edge here and press OK. Now we can hide this surface a little bit, we have this project line here. Select the two-point rectangle, click here in this point. The rectangle has 30 millimeters here and 20 millimeters here. Okay. Select this two line here and make this a construction line. Now select the circle. Make a circle here with 50 millimeters of diameter and create another one with 20 millimeters of diameter. Okay. Go to Constraints and select Horizontal Vertical, select the circle and the midpoint here. Now select the three-point arc. Make an arc between the circle and this point here. And this point and this circle here. Make sure that this arc is tangent with this line and with the circle, okay? Select the Constraint, Tangent, select this line and this line here, this arc and this line, this arc and this circle here. See that we have this symbol, that means the arc is tangent with this line, and here means that this arc is tangent with this circle, okay? The same for this side. Go to sketch dimension. The radius here is 15 millimeters. Now go to trim and cut this arc here and finish the sketch. We have this. Now we'll transform this profile and surface. So select the patch here, select this profile and press OK. We have this two surface here. Now go to create a sketch, select the front plane, select the project including project the selection filter here, change to bodies, select this body here and press OK. Now go to three point arc, make an arc here. OK, go to sketch dimension, the distance between these two point, three millimeters. And the distance between this point and this line here, 25 millimeters. Now go to constraints and select the tangent. Make this arc tangent with this arc here and finish the sketch. Now 
go to modify and select split body the body to split is this surface here and the splitting tool is this line here press ok now remove the body 3 and body 4 select the both here click with the right button and select remove okay we have this now we need to make a surface between these two body here so go to create and select loft select this edge here and this edge here we have this here change the connected to tangent to the both profiles and press ok we have this ok now go to create and select mirror the object type bodies the object these three surfaces here the mirror plane select the right plane okay the operation here select a new body and press ok now we need to join all the surface so go to stitch select all the surface here and press ok we made this okay now we need to add a thickness to this surface so go to create and select a thicken select this face here the thickness here is five millimeters to outside okay make sure that extrude here is to outside not to inside here five millimeters and press ok operation new body we made this okay now go to solid here select the fillet select this edge this edge here this edge and this edge the fillet here is one millimeter now go to fillet again and select the outside edge here okay all the contour of this body here the fillet here is one millimeters okay and press ok now i will add some color here and here we finish our exercise so thanks for watching subscribe my channel for more and see you in the next video bye bye